Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can download and install NetBean with Java JDK. So to install NetBean, first we have to download the required file. For that, open your favorite browser. So I'm going to use Google Chrome and search for Java JDK. And open the first link which says Java SE Download Oracle Technology Network Oracle. So don't worry about the link. Link will be on the description box. After you open that link, you will be on this page. So here you get two options. One is Java Platform JDK 10 and another one is NetBean with JDK 8. So we are going to download this NetBean with JDK 8. Just click this download option. So to download the required file, first we have to accept the license agreement. So let us accept the license agreement and here we have to select our operating system. So you can find here Windows x86 and Windows x64. So this Windows x86 is 32 bit operating system and this x64 is 64 bit operating system. So if you don't know whether your operating system is 32 bit or 64 bit, just search system. So under this setting tab, you will find system. Just click this system option and here you will find operating system type. So my operating system is 64 bit. So I'm going to download 64 bit version. So just click this download link. So as you can see here, download has been started. So it is around 340 MB. So it will take some time. So after completing the download, I will show you how you can install the software. So the download has been completed. So let's install the file. To install your file, just click on the file. Then click on yes. It will going to install Java Development Kit and NetBean IDE. So I will minimize my browser. And here we have the installation wizard. So here as you can see here, it is configuring the installation. So here we get the welcome screen. So here we have welcome to JDK 8 updates and NetBean IDE 8.2 installer. So as you can see here, the installation size is 795 MB. So just click on next. So this is your Java JDK folder. So don't change the default location. Just click on next. And this is your NetBean IDE location. Don't change anything. Just keep it default and then click on next and then click on install. So it is installing Java JDK and NetBean IDE. So it is around 795 MB. So it will take some time. So the installation process has been successfully completed. So here it will ask you to select this contribute to the JetBean project by providing enormous user data. I will suggest you not to check this box. Then click on finish. So here we have the NetBean IDE. So let us open the NetBean IDE. So here it is opening NetBean IDE 8.2. So here we have the IDE. So first let us check the Java version. To check your Java version, just search CMD or comment prompt and open comment prompt and here just write Java, then hyphen, then version, then hit enter. And here you will find your Java version and your Java runtime environment built number. So let me maximize the window. So this is the welcome screen. So I'm just going to close this welcome screen and to create Java project, just click on file, then click on new project. And here you have to select your category. Here you can develop Java or Java FX. So right now I want to develop Java application. So I will select Java, then Java application, then click on next. Then give your project name. For now, I'm just going to keep it default. If you want to change, you can change your project name. Then click on next. So it will going to create a Java project for you. So here on this project window, here you will find Java application, your Java project name. And when you expand this, here you will find your source package and your source file. So this is my source file. So application one dot Java. So dot Java is the extension of Java file. So here let me print hello world to print hello world. Just write system dot out dot print. Then between this parenthesis, let us write hello world and then put semicolon. And to run your program here, you will find run button. Just click on this run button and in your console here, you will find hello world. If you want to learn Java programming, I already have a playlist on Java programming for beginners. So don't forget to check that playlist. So the playlist link will be on the description box or it will be on the I button. 
So I hope this video was helpful to you. If you like this video, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more programming videos like this. Bye for now. See you in next video.